Bills Mafia, what's up? Mike Lindsley with you for an ML Sports Take. What to look for tonight as the Bills are in Pittsburgh. I got my eyes all over Andy Isabella, man. This has been a great story so far. The speed, and you can see the second-round talent in this guy. The Bills, if he is able to play really well tonight... I got to be honest, I don't know if you can keep him off the roster at this particular point. He might be able to help you out in punt returns, kick returns, and all the rest. I think that could be a big, big thing for uh, Andy Isabella. And, um, you know, obviously he was with the Cardinals and the Ravens gave him a try, and now he's on the Bills, and he could really provide something. Now, I know he's a wide receiver, and I doubt the Bills will carry seven, but why not get this guy out there on the special team side? I think they do need a burner somewhere, and he could provide that. Now, obviously, the Mike linebacker spot is something to watch as we move forward. Will Specter get some time? Klein get some time? Obviously, you have a Bernard with the injury. It appears as though it's going to be Dodson's job to lose. Uh, we'll keep an eye on that tonight as well. I think James Cook is going to have a huge year. I'm predicting over 1,100 total yards from scrimmage for James Cook. I'm interested to see how much more of the playbook Ken Dorsey releases here this evening as well. They need to see exactly what's going to happen with that uh, CB2 spot. Uh, as well. I do think Dane Jackson has a leg up there over Kyer Elam and company. Um, and one other thing, obviously, to follow, please stay healthy, everybody, including Josh Allen, who's going to get about a quarter, quarter and a half of action tonight. Bills Steelers in Pittsburgh this evening. Go Bills.